hello guys welcome back to a new video so today we are going to see acid fast staining acid fast staining was first discovered by paul ehrlich and zeal and nilsen modified this acid fast staining then it is known as zeal nilsen stain or modified acid fast staining now what is the procedure for acid fast staining there are only three things the first is carbol fusion 20% sulfuric acid and next is methylene blue uh first we will add uh, primary stain that is carbol fusion 1% carbol fusion is added and uh, it will be left for 5 minutes then we will then we will do intermittent heating to it uh intermittent heating means 2 to 3 times until the vapor arises from that and after after that uh, here we will we will not use any any kind of moderant but in primary stain we will use the moderant uh, here primary uh, here primary stain itself act as moderant so any moderant is not added then we will add the decolorizer decolorizer is 20% sulfuric acid and uh, in many of the colleges they will give tuberculosis bacilli only and uh, that's why we will use 20% sulfuric acid and uh, after that we will use methylene blue as a counter stain after adding uh, like um, carbol fusion 20% sulfuric acid methylene blue every time you, you need to wash this slide okay then if the acid fast organism seen then it retain retain the red color if non acid fast it will be blue color okay uh, what you will see on after this staining you will see uh micro if micro bacterial tuberculosis it appears as a long slender straight or slightly curved and beaded appearance red colored acid fast bacilli okay you should not write like i saw uh, tuberculosis bacilli or i saw lepra bacilli it will be a acid fast bacilli that's it you no know, don't specify which bacilli so here is the procedure first initially all the bacteria will be colorless then we will add the primary stain both the my uh, acid fast and non acid fast take up this take up the color then we will add 20% histose of all the, the organisms which which do not have mycolic acid in their cell wall lose up the primary stain then we will add the secondary stain the uh, non acid fast organism take up the secondary stain but not the acid fast organism uh, this acid fastness of any bacteria is due to presence of mycolic acid in their cell wall so you will see uh, the right side is a real picture you will see the same red color beaded appearance bacilli on microscope so you can see gram positive have thick peptidoglycan gram negative has a very thin peptidoglycan layer and they have lipopolysaccharide and uh, in acid fastness acid fastness is due to presence of mycolic acid in their cell wall okay uh, the uh, mnemonic to remember acid fast organism mainly you rem remember nocardia uh, legionella bacterial spores isospora mycobacterium and uh, last uh, cryptococcus cystis cyclospora okay next we will use the 5% histose of 4 for mycobacterium leprae 0.5% for nocardia uh, 0.25 to 0.5% of histose of for oocyst of cryptosporidium and isospora bacteria uh, mycobacterium leprae is less acid fast than the mycobacterium tuberculosis therefore 5% of histose of for is instead of 20% okay uh, they will ask like why 5% histose of for is used for mycobacterium leprae it is because uh, mycobacterium leprae are less acid fast so here is the differentiation between the gram stain and the acid fast staining okay Uh, take a screenshot of this and uh, keep it for revision purpose so some of the uh, mcq question arrange this in a gram staining order gram stain order first first remember in uh, gram staining first we will add the blue color at and last we will add the pink color so which is a blue color or violet color first we will add crystal violet then we will add moderant then we will add a uh, decolorizer that is acetone alcohol then we will add the secondary stain that is diluted carbol fusion okay arrange the order it will be come like this next gentian violet colorization of gram positive bacteria is due to presence of peptidoglycan layer okay next hiv patient of chronic diarrhea presents to opd with stool examination and uh, these are the oocyst okay oocyst are means uh, nocardia so we will use uh, oocyst for oocyst we will use 0.25 to 0.5% okay decolorization in zn staining is done by which most commonly used you should take on take the answer that is 20% histose sulfuric acid or okay another one stain is there albert stain which is used for uh, staining the diphtheria bacilli we will see dark blue metachromatic granules at the one end and with a in a green bacilli and they are arranged in a cuneiform arrangement in gram staining and uh, that is v and lens shape okay and uh, don't we don't need the procedure of albert staining we will see mm, so they will ask most most commonly asked viva question for acid fast staining is they, they will tell name some organisms of which show acid fastness and what what amount of decolorizer you will use for mycobacterium tuberculosis 25% or 20% for leprae you will use 5% nocardia 1% and uh, cryptosporidium cyclospora microsporidia 
we will use 0.5 percent and bacterial spore we will use 0.25 to 0.5 percent okay this is most commonly asked take screenshot of this also another one is there they will ask the what is rntcp rntcp is revised national tuberculosis control program and they will also ask what is N netp national na ntep national tuberculosis eradication program and they will ask what are the guidelines for uh, grading of a uh, zn staining for uh, tuberculosis okay for acid fast bacilli if no acid fast bacilli in 100 oil immersion field then we will uh, and we will see such 100 slides and if uh, no bacteria no acid fast bacilli are seen we will grade it as zero if one to nine per 100 oil immersion we will grade it as scanty and positive 10 to 99 per 100 oil immersion field plus one one to ten uh, we, per oil immersion okay in one oil one circle we will see one to ten bacilli then it will be plus two if uh, more than ten bacilli are seen per oil immersion field then it will be plus three okay the grading is most commonly asked question go through it one more important question uh, like uh, what other modifications modifications of acid fast staining that is quinones cold acid fast staining it differs from the zn staining by uh, no intermittent heating is required and phenol concentration in the carbon fusion is increased and uh, the duration of carbon fusion staining is more and we can use a uh, melachite green as a counter strain four things are there okay quinones cold acid fast staining is a modified another modified form of acid fast staining Cover the smear with carbon fusion and then heat it. But do not char, be careful. See the fumes. Now wash it with distilled water. Then put the decolorizer. Now again wash it with distilled water. Now stain it with methylene blue. For more, follow Dr. R.